ministry of the truth through, through preaching. It, that's probably one of the most delightful aspects of salvation is, uh, is the aspect of the way God has done. Uh, only God can in a very uncomplicated way. Uh, it uh, reveals such a, uh, a great salvation uh, through the message, through a message that requires faith. Um, I, I, I always, I, I love it when we can look into this, the way God has done, he's given us a, he's given us a message. He, it, this, when you crack this verse open, like Brother Aaron has done, actually, he started from the very beginning, and, and he's taking it all the way to the end, where, uh, you know, God has done a work. He gives a message, or he's, he's gonna, he says something he's going to do, he does it, and, he, and, he, and then we, we're given to believe that, and God gives us uh, the wherewithal to believe it, um, and it's, so we have we have salvation. We have the we have the gospel encapsulated in uh, in just a couple of verses here. And there's there we just got started on 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 this here. There's, there's a lot there. I um uh, I was uh, impacted uh, that now it's uh, it's through this gospel a message that actually will enter into the rest that God that God has given. Now this. Uh, at this rest that they were promised, the Israelites were promised, actually was going to be in, they were going to have to go into Canaan and they were going to, in conflict, they were going to have to take the land and drive out the Canaanites. Uh, we're actually uh, uh, have uh, tasting first fruits of the rest now, but in, in the same way that we have to drive out the Canaanites, but we do have this rest uh, none of the, uh, nonetheless. Because we're we're do, we're doing it through Jesus Christ. Our rest is in Him. That's a very good point uh, that He made. You know that Israelites uh, they could have they could have they could have fellowship with God uh, in the land. They could have had fellowship with God in the land, and they could have they they had a promise of blessing, and they could have waited with God in, in expectation of Jesus Christ. You know they, that was uh, that was available to them. And uh, it was made possible for the next generation to come in and take the land. They could have done this, but uh, it wasn't given given to them uh, to uh, take a hold of this. Now, um, I uh, the exhortation then is uh, is unbelief. Beware of unbelief. That uh, the same unbelief that prevented uh, the Israelites <clears throat> from being able to take hold of the promise and, and word they were given. Uh, they had, uh, God has never said anything that wasn't unrelated to salvation, even in the very beginning. Everything, he, he never said anything that wasn't a, a, a building block, so to speak, or, or part of a foundation he was building. Everything God ever said was, in, was related to salvation. So everything that uh, he's ever given man, would, had, had, would, if they would have believed it, would produce in them the results that God intended for them to have. So uh, the word that God had given uh, the, the Israelites, they would have believed that this would have produced in them the, the, uh, the intention of God. So this is... Uh, our exhortation then is to is to take hold of these things, and uh, and and uh, take hold of the message, and and believe it. Uh, our rest, a wonderful word. Uh, our rest. I'm, I'm thinking that a man now you can, a man you can, a man can rest now from his own his own abilities. I can rest from my own efforts. You know, I can rest in Jesus. Okay, I don't have to. Now, don't get me wrong. Now, I got I to gotta be in Jesus, of course. But then I can rest from seeking my own righteousness because uh, righteousness has been imputed to me through Him. Uh, this is a, it's a good word. Uh, dwelling in God through Jesus Christ. Our rest. We can, we can have victory in Jesus Christ in the midst of our struggle. In the midst, in the midst of uh, uh, dwelling and taking over Canaan, brother, do you have any uh, comments you'd like to make?